Croft continues to create difficulties for us. She's rallied the Valley people from their squalid huts and helped lead them to a series of victories. I wish I could make her understand just how wrong she is. How misguided her ideas of morality are. The world is too flawed for stopgaps. A lone hero cannot rescue it. The idea of revealing the Divine Source to the world would be laughable if it wasn't so dangerous. Did I think she could be turned to Trinity's side before? Yes. But not anymore. We were close, she and I. There is a bond there, but... I think now there is no other choice. She must be broken. And I know she can be broken. I've broken stronger than her. Vessels, Greek fire, the Prophet's deathless army, armed with Greek fire, they were unstoppable. <coughs> oh, that smell, oh no, burned alive. with Greek fire. I wonder if it will still burn. <coughs> the church in the West has sent their messengers, self-proclaimed soldiers of God, the Knights of the Order of Trinity. They have come to silence the Prophet, to quell his blasphemy and eradicate our movement. But it is too late now. We will not be silenced. Violence erupts in the Forum on a daily basis. The Prophet knows that we cannot stand against them, so we must leave Constantinople. We will go to the desert to build anew and continue the Prophet's work. died, the Prophet's favor was lost, and we were forced to begin our exodus in the dark of night. The new Emperor has no love for the Prophet, so there was nothing left to stop the Knights of the Order of Trinity. We fled towards the desert, to begin again, when the Order of Trinity came upon us, and murdered the Prophet. I saw him die. We placed his body in a cave near the oasis and in our sorrow, began to build him a tomb. The Order of Trinity is not finished. They desire not only the death of the Prophet, but the mysteries of the Divine Source. They will come again. But in our darkest hour, the Prophet has risen. He has defeated death, just as he will defeat our enemies.
Oh no. Sulfur. This whole place could go up. Got to hurry. Here! I fucking got it! I think I see my exit. The statue's unstable. Looks like I'll have to use the Greek fire. Just got to take out the remaining supports. standard of the Prophet's army. This would have been mounted above a flag and carried by a standard bearer.
When the Knights of the Order of Trinity learned of the Prophet's rebirth, they attacked again. But we were armed with true faith. Where they expected a slaughter of helpless refugees, they found an army of men and women who would no longer be victims. Many died there, but in the end, we stood victorious. We fled, leaving his tomb and the Empire behind. We walked for months, across the high plains, and into the frozen lands beyond the borders of the Empire. The path was difficult, and many began to doubt the Prophet. I am ashamed to say I did as well. I hope he can forgive me, for with the break of dawn, we now see the truth. He has brought us to an earthly paradise, where we can begin anew. God bless the Prophet, for he has delivered us. the way of it. One more support left. Looks like they were always prepared for war.
Mm, there's still more to do here. I'll be back this way. soldier's flag to be hung from a spear. This must have belonged to the Prophet's army. Still more to do here. I'll be back this way. Trinity has twice before sent great men seeking the Prophet's path, and twice before they have vanished. He carried the Divine Source out of the Empire, but it was not his to take. That blasphemy taints everything while his descendants still live. So Trinity must try again. I have done ungodly things committed terrible sins against the innocent just to reach this place. To retrieve the divine source. I know God will forgive for what I do. I do for the greater good. Now the end is in sight. I need only survive this final battle and Trinity's work will be done. Some of the words have been scratched out, but it seems to be pointing towards something. Hey! 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 Hey!
out. Lara, ah, thank God you're all right. Bring the Atlas to me and our observatory in the mountains. I'm on my way. This commemorates the construction of a great city. Is that you? <laughs> Little bird! You're alive! I, I knew it! My god! Jonah, what are you doing here? Where are you? I'm up here in some kind of fortress. You can thank Jacob. His people picked me up half dead out on the tundra. I can't believe you came after me. <laughs> Is that so hard to believe? I told you I got your back. I couldn't leave you out here alone. I'm on my way up to you now. Don't go anywhere. I hadn't planned on it. Be careful out there. <laughs> 